a moment. President Strand believed in American Reconstructionism. She worked tirelessly to bring the nation together again. And without her, there would be no bridges. She deserves a funeral with full honors. But we can't give her that. If she dies, America dies. Without her, bridges will cease to be. Listen. Her cremation must be carried out with the utmost secrecy. Even if we pull it off, what then? Who's gonna take her place? Face it. America's history. Sam, America isn't dead yet. He just said that it dies if Bridget dies. She may be lost to us, but we still have an America worthy of the presidency. Sorry, what? Let's not get into it now. What matters is that we're going to finish your mother's work and rebuild America as she intended. That's the reason Bridges exists. So take the first step, Sam, and deliver the president's body to the incinerator. If we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Who says I looked up some info about this game and I don't think you're ever gonna get it. It's too philosophical. The facilities to the southwest. Remember that you'll be passing through BT territory. We built the incinerator way up in the mountains so that the chiral matter in the smoke wouldn't reach the city. It won't be easy carrying a body up there. <sighs> Tabby, thank you for we'll gifting the subscription the to Laguna. If anything comes up, we'll offer you support by the couplings. That was very sweet. Thank you. To be honest, I never would have guessed anything either. I'm actually more lost after looking up the info. <laughs> We've got our dead mother on our back. Sam, this is Die Hardman. Dead men explain how to use the cuffs, right? Use them to check the location of the incinerator. We're right here. So we're literally just going... Wait. This is the incinerator here. What is this? What is this for? We don't need to do that right now, right? We need to just go straight to the incinerator? Can I say one thing that won't give anything away? Yes. Yes, you can. I'm confused. I'm confused on if we're supposed to go. Why is there a line going to this? Oh, that's cool. You can push up on, on the, like the, the pad and then you can move your controller and it tilts the map. That's, that's awesome. Um, I guess we're going to go straight to the... We got a dead body on our back. That's our mom. So I guess we're just going to go to that. Can't say that I know what that other area is for. transporting corpses for disposal. 48 hours following cardiac arrest, they go necro and become a fresh BT to make our lives hell. <laughs> well, maybe I should be careful running.
I don't know where I'm going because I can't even find the mark that I placed. Oh, we gotta hold L1, don't we? There we go. That lady in the cave isn't his sister. Her name is Fragile. His sister's name. Oh, that. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. I forgot she said her name. You are a thousand percent correct. President Bridget Strand was the symbol of American Reconstructionism. Even with the country shattered and its people scattered to the four winds, she never stopped believing they could be reunited. People held on to their hope that America would rise again because they believed in her. We believe that this country can be rebuilt. America lives on, together with Bridget's undying spirit. We also know that they think they can rebuild America and that if all the people get, like, come together, they can defeat these things that are here and recreate America. I mean, I would need a little more information on that. Just how did y'all come to the conclusion of that? But This game is really weird. <laughs> it's cool. Like, I love the cinematics of this and everything. It just feels more like a movie than a game. I feel like I'm not doing much game-wise. Yeah. Yeah, just like that. Let me see where we're at on our map. What I really wish is that it would keep up that so that I can... I wish it would keep it right there so we can see it. I don't know why it constantly has to come off. I'm wondering if I can make this a YouTube series with the music in here. Feels like it's not very DMCA friendly. I may not be able to post this to YouTube like I'm wanting to. Can you think of anything more depressing than carrying your mother's dead body on your back? This is, man, these graphics are beautiful. I really, really like the graphics. The story's interesting. I'm very curious to see what happens. I'm just still standing by that 
I wish there was more game to this. It's it's like Pixel was saying earlier, 60% cutscenes. I would like more game. But story-wise, I'm very intrigued to keep playing. Let's make sure we're still going the right way. Okay, yeah, we should just follow. Just follow that uh, lake or river. River, there we go. It is so much different from what I thought this was going to be. Like I said, not have watching, not have watched any gameplay to this at all. Oh, that's just a little ladder thing. Do we want to go? No, we don't need to go across that. Um, not have played any gameplay at all or watched any or even seen a trailer or, or anything. When we first started and seen those things that turn invisible, I was thinking like the goal of this was going to be like a shooter, shooter type situation or something dealing with them. But we only see them in cutscenes. We haven't even ran across any in gameplay wise. Finding ropes and other helpful items. More easily used terrain scanner. That's what I tried to do using. Uh, Odrex terrain scanner causes nearby ropes, ladders, and other useful items to flash, making them much easier to find. Okay, so it's you gotta quickly hit R1. I was uh, holding it down. There's a ladder over here. How is he running up the ladder like that? Okay, can we go up? This guy's like the world's greatest mountain climber. Can't climb up any. Oh, yeah, yeah, we can. We got this poor dude running all up and down these mountains carrying dead bodies and drugs. 
<laughs> what a life. Okay, so... That should be it right there where that building is. Alright, we made it. So this is where they carry all the dead bodies. So that's the place. You can save your current progress by opening the cufflinks. Okay, well, it feels like they're telling us to save. Let's do it. Wait, how do you do the save? In selecting system? Where do you see system? Oh. I wonder if it auto saves. I guess not. I guess you have to save your own progress. I'm glad we got this far to figure that out before we cut it off. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, you better hurry up and quit playing. This is a long ass game by the way. Yeah, I know, I seen it was like 30 something hours. I'm playing the whole thing on stream. So probably what I'm gonna do is play the whole thing on stream and uh, on New Year's Eve that Saturday. I'm probably gonna do a. I'll probably do a stream that day. Probably in the morning. And knock out a bunch of it. Or hopefully the rest of it. Chiralium density in the area is climbing rapidly. Heavy time fall is imminent. Get back here, now. Sam, burn the other cargo while you're there. What's this? BB-28. It's the unit Igor was assigned. It was hooked up to you when we found you in the crater. But why is it here? It's the baby! Because it's flagged for disposal. Central Knot's gone, and our headquarters along with it. Because that thing didn't do its job. It's all in Igor's logs. But it's still it's alive. Baby. It can't be repaired. And it can't survive outside the pod. Pity it if you want. But the decision has been made. It has to go. Who's the, the baby? Director approved the order. Uh oh. Uh, W24 hour stream? Ooh, I don't know if it'll be 24 hours.
you do three and a half hours per stream, it'll take you eight and a half streams to finish. <laughs> I mean, oh shit! Motherfucker! Damn! Do you want the baby? Learn about the baby soon? Okay, good. Clipped, of course you clipped it. Um. Sam, do you copy? Damn it, must have lost you in the blackout. Sam, what's your status? Chirelium density is still increasing. My status is fucked. There's tons of them. Lost me from the bodies we couldn't get up to the incinerator in time. Comes with the territory, I'm afraid. Can you sit out the rain? No. They're closing in on my position. I have to move before they realize I'm in here. Sam, if one of those things eats you, it'll trigger a void out. You'll come back, sure. But the surrounding area will still be a crater. You fucking sent us here, so... How about you shut up and let I me get out of here? I got an idea. The baby! You're gonna give him the baby? But yeah, I'm sure on New Year's Eve I'm gonna do a long stream. There probably won't be a stream tomorrow though. I'll put it in the Discord. Start your shit. Maybe you are defective. There they go! On those damn strands. I feel like I just got what Tabby was saying earlier about death stranded. So you are dead on strands, right? Keep low. And move cautiously. Ooh, that's fucking scary. Oh my god! How about please don't fuck me up? I think stranding is used to me stranded like no oh nowhere else to go ah Oh my 
God, did y'all see that? Can we just stop moving for a second? Oh my god. Where is... Is that it? Just them? Oh my god, that was too cool. I think we're okay. Okay, let's look at our map. So we can figure out where we should be going. Capital City, not. Okay, so we're going here. Well, that was trippy. I'm not gonna lie, I thought we were gonna die. When those, when those creepy demon looking things were coming out the ground, I thought we were gonna die. Enemy encounters produce a rush of adrenaline that rapidly restores stamina. Your stamina drops quickly once the rush passes, however, so be sure to rest or drink from your canteen to recover. You didn't even tell me how to use my canteen. Drink on Monster Energy, they were definitely sponsored by Monster. Do you get why you have the baby yet? No. <laughs> I still don't know the baby. I get that they want to destroy it. Is that, is that? Oh, okay, that's just the rope. Okay, so we could probably go ahead and just cross over here at this ladder. I left, came back, and you're still running up and down a mountain. No, I mean, you missed the... The action got real. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, I almost died. I'm not gonna be able to put this on YouTube, am I? Two clips in the Discord. Oh! Also, real quick, while we're talking about DMCA's and stuff, I just want to say YouTube is way worse on DMCA strikes than Twitch, by the way. Way worse. 
All this music is licensed, so the VOD might get flagged. Yeah. Damn, that sucks. I may not be able to put this on YouTube. Which really, I don't know if it's a really good game to post on YouTube anyways. I really don't think it's a good like a good game to stream either. Just because it's like so heavy cutscenes. You might be able to turn off the music. I know, and you see, I thought about that, and then I thought, well, I've already... You know what I mean? Like, I've already started the game, like... And the music's already in. So even if I cut it off now... For next stream? Yeah, yeah, for sure. But it just, like, it wouldn't... I still wouldn't be able to post it on YouTube because it'd be missing a whole other half. I mean, I can do it for Twitch. But YouTube, it's already too late. We're already here. But YouTube definitely gives... Oh, for Twitch. Gotcha. I thought you were talking about YouTube. What I thought I would do was make a YouTube series like my first time playing Death Stranded. But like I said, I didn't know it was like so heavy, like 60% cutscene and a bunch of licensed music. So it may not be the best thing for YouTube anyways. But, you know, it is what it is. Because YouTube... YouTube has flagged way more stuff for me than Twitch has. Clear. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Welcome to Capital Not City. Proceed to Distribution Center. And can I just say, creating content on YouTube is super overrated. Sam. I don't think it's that much better than... back to the Distribution than, Center. Posting on Twitch. Like, people complain so much about Twitch's rules and stuff. But I feel like YouTube... Me... I can only speak for me and my content. They have been way more strict on my content on YouTube than they have on Twitch. Your roommate distracted you. Welcome back, Tappy. YouTube has... Yeah, YouTube has flagged a bunch of my videos. I know uh, one of my Fortnite videos got flagged because of uh, that dance that I like the way you jiggle jiggle or wiggle wiggle. I don't know. It's been so long since I sung it. But uh, riding in my feet, you really got to see it. Like, they flagged me for that. What are you looking behind you for? Is somebody? Oh. Why don't you scare me like that? Yeah, YouTube is super strict. I don't know why people make it act like... YouTube is much better to go post your content on. No, I mean, of course, it's probably better, like, Just for getting noticed. But and me. When it comes to rules and things like that, YouTube is way more strict. We played, like, went on Spotify and played <laughs> hardcore licensed music on here and didn't get flagged. I don't recommend doing it. We have done it. You never got flagged on Twitch? Me neither. I got I got a warning one time. One time they sent me a warning about uh, me playing too much, playing a whole bunch of music. Am I in the right spot? Sam, you know how to get back to the distribution center? Hurry back. No, oh, well, fuck you. I thought I was here. Dang, I went all the way to the... Oh, that's fucked up. Every time I put a, a VOD up on YouTube, they always restrict it. Yep, that's what happened to me when my Fortnite one got restricted from Russia. You can't play there. And then, um... I got a few... That got flagged, but then they were like, well, the copyright, uh, the dude who made the song is fine with, uh, people using it for content. I'm like, well, cool, so can you, like, take off, take off that it's flagged?
I like YouTube Shorts though. Like posting on YouTube Shorts is pretty cool. trying to dispose of this baby. <laughs> hey, BB. Mads Milkison? The baby! Oh shit! That's a different guy. 